Hello everybody and welcome back to another Minecraft update video. Today we're going to be taking a look at Snapshot 13W36B which is a bug fix snapshot for the one that was released yesterday. There are no new features however there were a few things that I missed in my video so I'm going to go through those later on in this one but first of all we're going to go through all the bugs and bug fixes. So I've actually found a bug myself if I type I like this and press enter you can see nothing happens but if I press the letter E whilst typing and then press enter it opens up my inventory screen so I'm going to be submitting that one to the bug tracker but right now we are looking at the Mesa biome now this wasn't available to see in yesterday's snapshot because there was a problem and it caused the biome to bug out when it was generated so we're going to go and have a look at that in a moment but this is pretty much what it looks like I've had a little fly around here and this basically spawns at different height levels you can see over in that distance there is one that is a lot lower down. Now one thing I've observed about this is that there's different colours of hardened clay and stained clay but also there's these dirt patches which the grass don't spread onto. Now we know they added a dirt block which would stop grass from spreading onto it but if we middle click on this you can see um, that we don't get the damage value 1. So if I go into game mode 0 and we do a quick test and there you go I pressed E so it opened up my inventory and we break one of these blocks manually well let's throw those ones away just in case they stack but it looks like you're unable to obtain these types of dirt block in survival which is a little bit unfortunate um, but before we go and have a look at the bugged out biome Dinnerbone has made a little change in the menu here again if we click on the super secret settings it now will create a random noise for us to hear so obviously he's trying to make a little bit of hype for this I don't know what on earth it is he's got planned um, but he's definitely got me interested so this is the bugged out Mesa biome from yesterday's snapshot. If I press F3 you can see we're at the similar coordinates and the same biome and we're in the previous snapshot. So just having a look around at this now I can see actually what's happened. None of the stained clay or hardened clay blocks have actually been generated into the world. You see this patch of dirt up here with the trees and the grass, that's the same as what we were looking at a moment ago and everything else is pretty much the same except those blocks haven't generated. So a strange bug indeed. Uh, but now that has been fixed of course. So while we're in 36A I thought we would take a look at the bugs and then I can show you them fixed in 36B after. So this first one is to do with attacking mobs with an unenchanted sword. You can see here we get the enchanted particle effect which we should not be seeing because this sword is not enchanted. This next one it makes it pretty obvious how some of these bugs get into the game. And when we eat this, you see that we get the particle effect for the regular fish texture and not the texture of the one that we're eating. So that's obviously something that they forgot to update. And that is the same for all of the new fish, including the puffer fish, which I was incorrectly uh, pronouncing as the putter fish in the previous video. So this next bug, I'm sure many of you who checked out the snapshot would have seen. And whenever you left the game and came back to it again, all of your sound options would have gone all the way back to default, which is 100%. So it was, just, it was just forgetting to save it, and now that's been fixed, so your sound settings will be saved. Now this next one is a little bit unusual. If we go to this achievement give command right here, and I give myself an achievement I haven't already got, which I think would be that one right there. Nope, I've already given myself that one apparently. And there we go, when you get your achievement in the top right hand corner, the word is actually spelt incorrectly, so a small typo there that has been fixed. And another bug with achievements as well, there is this one here called the beginning, and there is no way to obtain that whatsoever, so uh, that has now been fixed as well. Let's go into 36B and have a look. So here we are in 36B, there is a bug in this snapshot that was supposed to have been fixed. If I open up a GUI screen like my inventory and press my screenshot button, there is no screenshot being taken whereas if I go out of it you can see here a screenshot can be taken so that is a bug that is supposed to have been fixed but is still in the game now if we hit this guy with a regular sword you can see there's no more enchanted particle effect and also if we eat the food it's been updated to give you the particle effect of the fish that you're trying to eat so as well as that the sound settings will be saved you can see here we go into here it's remembered the ones from when I was last playing I didn't have to come in and set them manually and as well as that, the typo has been fixed for achievements. In fact, I remember I put it on my clipboard. There we go, you can see the achievement spelling is now correct. So there are a few things that I missed from yesterday's snapshot. One of them being with packed ice, it does not melt. You can put it next to light sources and it will stay the way it is forever. Now if we break this with a regular pick, it makes the same noise as ice. Uh, but you need silk touch to pick it up. So here we are with a silk touch pick and you can see 
it drops the packed ice. This also has efficiency 5, which doesn't seem to make too much difference to breaking this block. Now, I don't know if that's a bug, uh, but you can see here, if it does make any difference, it is very, very slight. So something else that I missed from yesterday's snapshot was a new command, which is summon. If I press this button right here, we will summon a pig into existence. And we can do this with any type of entity, which includes the giant, which you weren't able to get into the game without using external tools. But now we have a way to do it in creative mode. Um, so you can see the command is very simple, slash summon the entity that you want. And then you can specify coordinates like that. Otherwise, it will spawn it directly on you. So if we type slash summon and then go to giant it will spawn a giant into the game. Look at that guy. <laughs> that is awesome. So one last thing that I missed from yesterday's snapshot, depending on what biome you're in, at a certain height, which is around 100 blocks, the rain when it's raining will turn into snow. So you can see here there is some snow in front of us, but also rain as well, because that's happening over here in the extreme hills biome. So you can see extreme hills, over here is river and then swampland. And so above 100 blocks, the rain will turn into snow. So that is it for this snapshot update video. I hope you've enjoyed it. So as always, thank you very much for watching and I will catch you next time.